The reigning regular season champion ULV Leopards women's basketball team will try to repeat the same success this year, this time with a new head coach. Anthony Mason returns home to the San Gabriel Valley after a two-year pit stop at Vassar College in New York. Rejoining the Southern California Intercollegiate Athletic Conference for the second time in his coaching career. The former Claremont Mudscripts Athena's assistant won back-to-back -back titles with CMS in 2014 and 2015. I think I know what it takes to win a championship and win a tournament championship here, what kind of consistency that brings, and that's the kind of consistency I hope to bring to the squad day in, day out. At Vassar College, Mason won a Coaching Staff of the Year award for the 2021-2022 campaign and had an overall record of 35-17 and 17 over two seasons. The Leopards are coming off a 24-win season, losing just three games under head coach Jason Pruitt, who resigned in April 2023. The Leos also lost veteran leadership, returning a younger, more inexperienced team this time around. Coach Mason will look to his team's captains to right the ship. Coming in this year, we have some of these upperclassmen that came in through COVID and were young and maybe don't have that same, those same years that they had, um, some of the leaders had. So it, it's, it's been a tough adjustment, but we know we're going to get there. Mason understands that last year's finish was not lost on this team, and they hold themselves to the same standards. I think the expectations are high, but not from any outside source. I think this group has a high set of expectations for themselves. Kiara Brown, one of the team captains and the team's leading scorer from last season, knows the outlook on this year will be different, but that it also goes back to the basics. Of course, we want to go back to back, but just got to have fun. Just want to play together, have fun, learn, just get better as a team. The Leopards lost their first game of the season, but picked up their first win against Southern California Leadership University on November 10th.